the everlasting gospel in the three angels' messages. Just imagine a global news broadcast being sent out to every corner of the earth in every language for every people, everyone to hear. The three angels' messages are like that broadcast, urgently reaching out to every person with the truth of the gospel and the call to worship God. Revelation chapter 14, verse 6. Then I saw another angel flying in midair, and he had the eternal gospel to proclaim to those who live on the earth, to every nation, tribe, language, and people. You know, the first angel's message proclaims the everlasting gospel to every nation, tribe, language, and people. This message is universal, calling everyone to worship the Creator and prepare for His soon return. It is a message of hope, a message of warning, and a message of salvation. In Benin, an evangelistic series centered on the three angels' messages led to a profound spiritual awakening. As people understood the significance of these messages in the context of the end time, many who had been lukewarm in their faith were stirred to recommit their lives to Christ. The series resulted in a significant number of baptisms and a renewed focus on mission in the local churches. Ellen J. White says, the three angels of Revelation chapter 14 represent the people who will accept the gift, the light of God's message and go forth as his agents to sound the warning through the length and breadth of the earth. Testimonies for the Church, volume 5, page 455. Friends, I want to encourage you today. As we engage in Word Impact 2025, let's boldly proclaim the everlasting gospel found in the three angels' messages. These messages are not just for a select few, but for every person on this planet. Let's take up the mantle as God's messengers, sharing his final warning and a call to salvation with the world. God bless you.